What's going on with the serve? We saw in 2023, a lot of the players were hitting a big serve, setting up the point really aggressively and getting on offense early. We're gonna talk through the new rule change on the serve, exactly what that's all about, and how to hit your serve as big as possible. All right, so here we're gonna break down the serve. We're gonna break down the serve at the different levels. So we're gonna talk through a serve at a 3-0 level all the way up to a 5-0 level and kind of the key mechanics with your body on how to get to that next level of the serve. We're gonna look at a closed stance motion, which I personally find a little bit easier. You'll see an open stance motion like this, where I'm facing the court. This is what a Tyson will do, and he gets a lot more whip with years a spin old. on it. So let's break it down. So we look at the body mechanics of this, and the first thing you wanna be thinking about on the serve is the rotation. So bringing those hips out. If I'm looking at just a basic serve, if you can get the hips through it, that's gonna be your most basic serve. That's gonna be where we're gonna start. So, focus one, hips through the serve. That's level one of the serve. It's just that hips are coming out through the serve. Now the next thing we're gonna focus on is the legs. We're getting low here. This is adding a little bit more power. I'm really engaging those legs as I'm hitting it, and I'm getting the hips still. So see how that's coming a little bit faster? That's the next level. So legs and hips. All right, so we've got the legs and the hips now. Now we're gonna start adding a little bit more. This is starting to get to the advanced level serve. So you have, think about it, the hips are gonna give you that initial power. Legs are gonna give you a little more. Now we're gonna work on the whip to get that ball kicking on the serve. Look at the plane of my paddle here. I'm going up through it. This is what's giving me the shape on the ball. And I'm using this to get that spin. And with the spin, it's gonna come off the court quickly and add a little bit more variability to their return, making it a little bit more difficult. Look at that short return I just got. So, one thing else we're gonna focus on is the extension through. A lot of times I see people come across too quickly. We're gonna focus on really extending through. It's kind of that arrow principle I was talking about. You point towards your target as long as possible and then let the arm follow through. So here, we're gonna hit this, follow through, and that's gonna give me the depth. If you're missing in the net, that's probably a factor of coming across too quickly. When you're really focusing on the depth, this extension is what's gonna help you with that. Now we're gonna get really crazy here. We're gonna talk about the new pro serve. So the new pro serve, the big things are, the drop has to be waist level or below. I can't lift up with the drop here. So we're gonna focus on just releasing the ball and hitting through it. So you'll see here that when I'm in this, I start getting low. I get my wrist in this position. I start to swing a little early, drop it, and then go. That's the new serve. Low, motion start, drop, go through. Low, motion starts, drop, go through. This one definitely takes a little bit more coordination, so don't worry if you don't get it on the first couple. As you guys saw in Palm Springs, it took me a little while to get comfortable with this serve, but those are the mechanics and get as many reps on this as possible.